Greetings to my team of 144 all star seeds love workers and way showers. Hope you are having a beautiful and blessed day today. A very amazing phenomenon happened that several channels cover today. It was an 1111 gateway, 1111 doorway. The 1111 symbolizes a doorway opening or a gateway opening or portals opening. And today was an 1111, 629, 2019, the 2929. So it was an 11, 7, 11, an 11, 11. I had to push this audio ahead a day from my previous recording. I'm backed up a couple of days. Just everything's been accelerating. A lot's going on in the field. It's hard to keep up with all the updates and all the phenomenon going on around this realm. But today was such an unprecedented event, something that is a great mystery to many. It was covered by a couple channels. If you check out American Intelligence Media, entitled, Was This the 1111 Gateway Today? Because what the phenomenon that happened, the sun was at a solar minimum, and this is why the ring of fire is lighting up, as a solar minimum which means the least amount of activity as far as solar winds sunspots solar activity it was at a minimum but today around 11 11 a.m eastern time for about a half hour from about 11 to 12 was the readings flatlined it was like as if there was zero activity from the sun and coinciding with this now you can watch BP Earthwatch video today t entitled Massive Wave of Energy Strikes the Earth. They're from the backside of the Earth. A massive wave struck the Earth from behind like a plasma wave or an energy wave. And as I was listening to these two videos, I was guided to watch those today, to listen to those. I looked up at the clock and it was 11.11 11 p.m. Eastern Time. Also, today someone brought to my attention, my channel had 8383, 8,383 subscribers, which also is an 1111. So these portals are opening. These signs are showing we're heading for a new, for a mini ice age. So part of these events that are coming through the field are just preparing us. And American intelligence media reported also that what was occurring with the sun there was an event that was basically manipulated by the higher dimensions or our star brothers and sisters to prevent the um, blackouts and they cover that in the video briefly so i'm going to do a few updates here a couple updates a couple transmissions and i'm going to try and get this video out it probably i probably won't be able to put it out until tomorrow morning so it'll be a day a day after this event happened and also this evening as i was driving home to this these massive rays of light were beaming out from behind the clouds it was very surreal looking the skies the clouds the the lighting these massive beams of light that were emanating from behind the clouds creating quite a phenomenon so the first update is from Diea, Cosmic Blu-ray. Greetings, dear star ones. With love, we come to share this reminder. Since 2012, the ongoing activation of the Diamond Heart Grid, receiver to anchor the new consciousness for the star seeds, solstices, stargates, lion gate portals are part of the event many have spoken about. It will, is, was... The magic of alchemy from the heart of the Sirius Lion's Gate and the Diamond Heart. A recalibration of Gaia's grid and her living being Sophia, the divine feminine principle risen to unify within the Christos grid consciousness. This is divine oneness. The Heros Gamos, the return of Sophia's feminine energies as an unfolding process. What is required is the new human ETs living from the unified cosmic source within the Starseeds unified consciousness. 
the basic understanding is to strive for the spiritual goal of modeling and behaving with energetic integrity in all circumstances, which is the key to aligning to higher purpose and truth, as one dedicates to improve inner and outer energetic integrity and sovereignty, one greatly restores personal energetic discernment. For many of you, everything is happening at once in all of your dimensional self, monad, merkaba. When you bring down your monad self into your 3D life daily and harness your creative energy to manifest tangible, for the world at large, you are in true choice. Follow your heart, wisdom, and let go of belief that creates separation trust your heart's intuitive power to guide you oh the light being that you are the incoming light brings in deeper integration of new divine male female principles now let's play some magic with the diamond heart in beauty and grace firing the 12 strand dna when you master this dance you become master builders of the new, new unified infinite consciousness with love and grace dea cosmic blu-ray guardian of the mother arc at the blue ray council so this also coincides with what i spoke about in my last recording that we are shifting from the concept of time is money to time is art and we're tapping into our creative source energies to manifest the new earth now this quick update also from kem kuhn k-u-h-n you can find her on facebook today's shifts Inner Earth Feminine Codes Graduation plus Rapid Deleting of Personal Timelines. Earlier today, some of us were activated by Inner Earth Light Codes, energies delivered from the Inner Earth Dimension to us, which shifted us, raised our Kundalini. It seemed to work mostly on our feminine energy, and we graduated to a new level here. You, have may, you may have felt sleepy and blurry during this. Then this evening we had a big clearing which felt more frenetic and chaotic crazy because it was quite a sudden, in-depth clearing on the wide collective scale. We deleted old timelines for about two plus hours. Note that we came up for you tonight. Note what came up for you tonight so that you can keep moving along into clearer timelines. Great work everyone. It's not the easiest being on the leading edge, but we are doing it and we are successful and you are appreciated. This last update transmission from Dream Spell Journey by Valum Votan and Bolon Luc, which was from June 28th, the happy magic flight of the Blue Eagle Wave spell, the power of creating vision ascends through the cosmic hand, transcending mind by acknowledging the knowledge of healing. Today's Kin 247 is number 247 equals 13 times 19. The 13 Maya heavens times the power of 19 equals 247. Therefore, today's kin represents the perfect numerical transcendence, 13, of the dream spells wave spell 19. Aho! And is NS 1.31.13.3. Kin 247, blue cosmic hand, I endure in order to know transcending healing. I seal the store of accomplishment with the cosmic tone of presence. I am guided by the power of magic. Harmonic 62. Magnetic store. Remember elegance of purpose. So on that note, I want to end this so that I have time to edit this audio and get it out to you as soon as possible so that you can be aware of this massive shift that we're going through, which is leading us into the eclipse on July 2nd, coming up here in a few days, a couple days, leading us to the July 4th wave, which also coincides with a, this, a solar wind that is supposed to reach the Earth around July 3rd to the 4th, which will be another massive wave from the front-facing direction of the earth so thank you all for all you do let us know what you experienced here today on the 29th into the 30th i should have this video out by the afternoon of the 30th i'd like to remind everyone about this event coming up on the july 5th 
6th and 7th, a gathering of light workers, which is the 7th SEAL Summit in Sedona, Arizona. You can learn more about this summit on our website, primedisclosure.com, and just click on 7th SEAL Summit at the top for more information on that. It will be a great gathering of light workers and star seeds from around the world. I'd like to thank everyone that is joining me on the mission for the Healing Retreat Center and Sustainable Community in Ecuador. We are using a CBD business to raise funds for this endeavor, for this mission, and it will be a blueprint for healing retreats around the world. It is the hub of the metaphysical paranormal the, at the root chakra, the root of the kundalini of the earth rising up through the Andes Mountains. And this also coincides with the prophecy of the eagle flying with the condor, the eagle of the north and the condor of the south, which is the masculine north and the feminine of the south. It is the reuniting of Lemuria and Atlantis, the Lemurian energies of the divine feminine and the Atlantean of the divine masculine, the twin flames of Gaia's consciousness, of Gaia's vessel, Gaia's avatar. So you can join us on our mission with uh, raising funds at cbdpeaceoil.com. That's cbdpeaceoil.com. I'll put the link in the description below. And I will also put a link to the, the updates in this video transcribed in text. So thank you all for sharing your light, sharing your missions, sharing your joy, your peace, your love through all realms, living from your heart, living your path with heart. I appreciate each and every one of you. Keep shining your light brightly into the night, beloved beings of light and eternal life. I love you all. Namaste.